Hey guys! Hey! It's Kent and Shay again. What's up? For our fun fact of the day, we have um, this thing called the flooded forest. Um, which is basically, we told you last time that the Amazon can rise from 13 to 50 feet. Remember Kent's hand Yeah, gestures. exactly. When the Amazon does flood up to like 50 feet, it takes a lot of the forest with it. Um, and so there's like fish and pink river dolphins like swimming around at the base In of tree trunks. In between trees, it's crazy. 50 feet. Um, and <laughs> sloths. We learned that sloths can swim too. Do your best sloth swimming impression. The legs are funny. <laughs> so yeah, that's the fun fact, is that they're pink river dolphins. And, and that we can't do sloth impressions. And sloths swim, but we <laughs> can't. Anyway. We're going to be having some petitions at the end uh, that you guys can sign. They'll be in the description down there. And today, what we wanted to talk about was the Belamonte Dam. Big project happening in Brazil. It's a hydroelectric dam that's currently being built on the Xingu River. In Brazil, and it's been trying to be built since 1975, so it's been going on forever. Very stop ago, but when completed, it will be the third largest hydroelectric dam in the world. What's kind of, I think that the, the big like disparity is that um, a lot of people see it as this like renewable energy resource, and people are always like, renewable energy is great, and Brazil has like 46% uh, of its energy is renewable, and then 85% of that energy is hydroelectric, electric, which sounds great on paper. But it's, when it comes down to it, when it's being built, if it gets built and is completely Completed, it will flood 400,000 acres of land, which is about two New York cities. Yeah, so and when it floods that much land, you also have like 40,000 indigenous people being displaced. And an entire ecosystem that gets disrupted. Flooded forests are cool, as we yeah. just went over, but, but 400,000 acres. Flooded is... New York cities. Yeah. Not so cool. Yeah. Very day after tomorrow. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking, day after tomorrow. <laughs> Speaking of petitions to sign, you can always vote Daleks and stop extermination <laughs> today. If there are any Whovians out there. <laughs> Speaking of that t-shirt, it's time for t-shirt contest! T-shirt contest! Yeah. Who is your vote? Doctor Who or Batman? They're both really Mind cool. Mind glows in the dark. Daleks are literally pure evil. That like. That doesn't get cooler than that. Sends out a Batman beacon into the sky. <laughs> Batman could not beat a Dalek. Batman has underwear that has tools to fight crime in it. I have Batman underwear. Do they have tools in it? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Set myself up for that one! So I hope we taught you something about the Belamonto Dam, and I hope that you sign the petition, um, because it's very important to the indigenous people down there. And, and the world. And to us. This is Kenton Shea, swimming, swimming out. out.